All right, as you know, Father's Day next Sunday. Have you found that gift for dad yet? Probably not, but a lot of dads like gadgets, so the right gadget could be the perfect solution for you. Our tech expert, Katie Linendahl, joins me now with a few suggestions. Katie, are these a lot of gadget-related type of things for dad, or not just ties anymore, right? No, forget the ties. Right. It's time to give dad an upgrade. Okay. <laughs> and let me first start it off. I'm just going to roll through these. First is this revolutionary alarm clock. This is hot off the market, brand new. It is called Lark. And you might be saying, well, where's the alarm clock? It's actually on my wrist. It's a little comfy wristband that you wear. And here's the deal. Lark is made for couples that get up at different times. Oh. If you know dad is annoying mom because it's going off and being a loud buzzer and really annoying, this actually gently and naturally wakes you up, just kind of <laughs> nudging you. And the idea here is to wake up naturally and it will also track your sleep, which is incredibly cool because it will tell you where in the middle of the night that you're waking up and help you be a better sleeper. Wow. It's made by a Harvard scientist and it's also made by a sleep trainer for those that are in the NFL, the NBA, and the NHL. Okay, so how very high-tech gadgetry here. How pricey? It's about $129, okay, TJ. That's, that's doable, but it will wake you up. You're not going to sleep through it, right? That is correct, and it'll okay. also beep just in case. Just and in the case. next one I have here for you, it looks kind of like a coffee cup, right? Mm -hmm. It's actually a coffee cup inverter from ThinkGeek. It's about $30, and you'll see here there's a USB port and also two outlets. So for the dad on the go, from mm -hmm. to work or from work, maybe he wants to charge his tablet, maybe he wants to charge his smartphone or his MP3 player, no problem. This fits in your, coffee, in your cup in your car, and you can ah, charge those gadgets on the go. That's pretty good. And Last step in this little segment, TJ, I want to show you. With all that news on cell phone radiation, why even bother taking the chance? This is Pong. Now, this is a nice little colorful case. comes in a number of different shapes and sizes. And what it does is it's tested and proven in FCC laboratories to reduce radiation when you are talking on your cell phone. It goes anywhere from about 40 to 60 bucks, but a nice little option if you are not using that Bluetooth handset to protect yourself. Okay, that's a pretty good one too, and it, all these things are affordable. We're not done with Katie just yet. We've got a few more suggestions to do with Dad on his downtime, and Reynolds is getting involved in this one. You don't want to miss this. We're right back. <laughs> all right, let me rejoin Katie Lindendahl. Before the break, she was giving you some uh, ideas, some gadgets for Dad. She's got a few more here. Uh, where do you want to start? Yes, I want to go right to the Keurig self-brewing coffee machine because here's the deal, TJ. Okay. I'm a total coffee snob, but this has become my new BFF because what's <laughs> awesome about it is if dad wants to make coffee in the morning, yeah. it's not like brewing a pot. Everybody gets an individual pod. There's oh, 200 wow. different flavors. There's iced tea, there's apple cider, there's hot chocolate, and there's, of course, coffee, and everybody gets to pick Brilliant. exactly what they want. These range in prices and styles, but a nice little option to have around the house. And last but not least, I want to finish off with the ultimate geek dad. Okay. He deserves a USS Enterprise Star Trek pizza cutter. A pizza cutter. This is a the Star ultimate Trek upgrade, pizza TJ. Yep, a Star Trek pizza cutter, and it comes with a Star Trek robe, which we brought oh. in a model for this one. Yeah, yeah the Star good. Trek robe, it has the insignia and the, your rank on it, and Reynolds Wolf, showing it off in style. That's how it goes down. This is weird. <laughs> I, I, feel, I feel like I should have a, a highball glass of scotch and a cigar. I feel like Hugh Hefner wearing this thing. Seriously. The, Katie, people really go for these, and it has the little Star Trek symbol on it, but are these things really hot? They're popular? Oh, come on, the answer's in the question. Reynolds Wolf, he's kind of a big deal around there, you know. Oh, look at those. 18-inch python biceps. Nice. Wow. Yeah. Uh, exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Reynolds, you're a good sport. Uh, something like that. Since I've worked on this show, we have brought in one model to model something, and that has been Reynolds Wolf. Uh, <laughs> Reynolds, we appreciate that. Katie, we appreciate you. Some good stuff. Everybody getting ready for Dad next weekend. Reynolds, thanks. Quick break, folks. We're going to reset here for the top of the hour here on the CNN Saturday morning. We're right back.